What is going on guys, Wilmax Random Videos, back to another video. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to go about setting up OBS to record a VR. Yeah, anyways, let's get right into it. Alright, so I'm a little tired right now, but... Yeah. So... The um, first thing I would do, create a new scene, call it VR, of course. And then what I'm gonna take and do in this scene, my thing is set up weird because it's optimized so I have this as big as possible on my second monitor. But basically what I'm gonna take and do is I'm gonna set, the, I'm gonna take a source, I'm gonna add video, or no, not video, I'm gonna add a display capture, add existing main display for my just display, right? Then I'm going to add a audio input capture, and call it VR mic, and then set that, and then set it to my Oculus microphone, or whatever microphone I'd be using with Oculus if I had like a headset with a microphone coming off of it. But yeah, so you set that, like, then I'm going to have my application audio output capture and then what do you say? add existing game audio and if you don't have an existing game audio you'd set that to just you'd set that to normal audio I guess um and the reason we're doing it like this and if you go to properties on this one you wouldn't have set it to the you want to set it to what um ever game you're running and so and then you just sort of fiddle with these things until it starts actually registering audio with the game you're running and it might not e it might not even go through the game it might go through oculus or steam vr i'm not too sure on that so you just have to fiddle with this in order to get it right but that's how i would get that set up with VR, it's pretty simple, but if you wanted to, you add a webcam or something. I'm going to add my Discord thing to that, just in case I'm playing a VR game with some friends. And so, yeah, that's where I'd add that. And so, pretty much now what I'm going to show you how to do is show you how to record it to separate tracks within OBS, if you get what I'm saying. So it'll like, your mic audio will be on a different audio track in your editor than your game audio. And this is what I do for my videos. This is what I'm doing for this video because I have it set up Streamlabs for my microphone and the window and whatnot. But yeah. So basically what I'm gonna take and do is I'm gonna go to settings. Why am I tired? Okay. And then output. And then you're recording, you're going to want to have these checked for as many audio tracks as what you're using. And so I have the first five checked to record. And one is all, I'm pretty sure, for my typical things. And then two is... Yeah, and then these are just the specific ones, but this one's generally all the audio. Because for streaming, I have that set to the default audio track. But so... Now what we're going to take and do is we're going to take, now that you've checked off the ones that you're going to use, you're going to go to your audio sources, or your audio mixer, and you're going to click the little settings wheel right there, and it's going to take you into this advanced audio properties thing, where this is where you're going to check the sort of like audio that you're going to be using, I guess hard to explain sometimes but so for these ones is i added a good bit of existing ones so it defaults to where i want them to go but if you're streaming you want to make sure you have your twitch vod track selected because this is what it's gonna or if you're streaming on twitch you want to make sure you have your vod track selected as for the your microphone and whatnot but I'm going to go ahead and set it to 1 and 2 and 6 for if I'm ever streaming in VR. Though that's a good bit more difficult to do. And I'm going to unselect it for the audio tracks I don't want it to record to. 
And so, just like that, we pretty much have our VR thing set up to go and ready to, like, be properly recorded and edited. And so, you want to make sure you full screen your game, though. Or change this, um, change your main display to a game capture. That way it actually just captures the, just the game instead. But I prefer to do it on main display so I can full screen the game and then get the highest resolution possible because I am a perfectionist about certain things. So, yeah. Anyways, that's how I would set up my OBS to record. And I have a video explaining the settings that I would use to record anything really in OBS. And that'll be in the little thing up here. And if that's not there, I don't know where it's been on YouTube recently. I'll have it linked in the description down below or on the end screen. And so be sure to check that out. But yeah. Um, leave a like if you enjoyed this video. Comment if this helped you. And just comment some other things with an OBS and DaVinci Resolve whatnot that I could possibly help you out on and make a video about. But yeah. Anyways. Yeah, subscribe if you're new. I'll see you in the next one. And good. Hi guys, I know I haven't uploaded in a while, but yeah, this is me talking while editing. I recorded this video a couple weeks ago, actually, and just haven't really had time to edit. I've been working on getting stronger and whatnot, and so, yeah, I've also been doing schoolwork and whatnot, and whatnot too, so, yeah. Anyways, I shouldn't be gone for as long as time. Bye. <laughs>